Kanjar go. He has returned as he does every season to harvest our bodies for fuel. Fuel? Interesting. We did not think you would return. Not after your last encounter with Kanjar Ro's terrible Gamma Gong. Ah. But you have returned to save the Gibble people once again. All hail the Blue One! Uh, thanks. Great to be back. Who are these people and how do they know me? The Scarab. Someone had it before you. I must have found a new host after the last guy was killed. Or, um, retired. Sidekick, why do you not bow? Sidekick? Uh, this is Batman, the greatest hero, like, ever? I mean, you should be bowing to him. What the Blue One is trying to say is that now he has returned. Kanjar Ro will surely be defeated and your people freed. No, not what I'm saying. And why are you encouraging this? All hail the Blue One! 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 All hail the Blue One? The blue one? What? Now these people think I can save them. I can barely work this suit, much less be the hero they need. What they need is someone to believe in. And what I need is for you to play along if we're going to save their people. But I'm telling you, they're not going to listen to me. You have to come up with a better plan. This is for you, for returning. Okay, what do you want me to do, Bats? Long way from Gorilla City, Grodd. Dinosaur Island's unique inhabitants will be the vanguard of a new civilization. A glorious gorilla nation. A utopia that will spread to claim the entire world. My E-Ray evolves humans into their ultimate expression. The intelligent ape! It only requires one more test. And I see two volunteers. Not interested. <laughs> Don't bother with the mind control, Grodd. I'm blocking it with a technique I learned in Tibet. <laughs> Superior being! Big shock, I know. But we're talking again, for the first time since I became king. After my brother's coronation, I admit pride made me do some foolish things, Batman. But age has brought wisdom and the lesson of the importance of family. Those years we were apart were hard on me, too. My men will look into who's responsible for this outrage. I know, I know. You don't trust him. 
A tiger shark doesn't change its stripes. He's family. Anyway, to what do I owe the pleasure of your visit, my faithful friend? Tell me you're joining us for our celebration this evening. Actually, I'm here to check out some unusual seismic activity along the shelf. Undersea plate movement? Happens all the time. See? Still, where Batman goes, adventure follows. Mind if I tag along? Eighteen, nineteen, twenty. And this will be the throne room. What do you think of the view, Black Manta? Too many buildings. I prefer an unobstructed ocean view. And I prefer an assassin who can shoot straight. You failed me, Manta. Only due to Batman's unexpected interference. Worry not. Soon we will correct the gross injustice that has denied you the throne. We've just been teleported. Ladies and gentlemen, the world's greatest detective. Okay, Doc, where are we? Better to ask, when are we? It is the 5th century AD, the place is Britain, and I am Merlin Ambrosius. No, really. Where are we? I'm convinced. You must forgive the suddenness with which I have brought you here. It was a desperate act by a desperate man. Not long ago, a student of mine, King Arthur's half-sister, Morgane Le Fay, seeking to wrest the throne from our beloved king, gathered her army and attacked Camelot. The Knights of the Round Table fought valiantly, but they were no match for Morgane's enchantments. Nor, I'm sorry to say, was I. The student had surpassed the master. Camelot fell. All within the castle walls were ensorcelled, transformed into things of stone. And a terrible darkness fell over the land. But hope remains. The sword in the stone. Excalibur. I hid it away years ago for just such a purpose. Only Excalibur's magic can defeat the Fey and restore our king. Then why haven't you used it? Only the one who is worthy can retrieve it. And this is why you brought us here. Well, don't keep everyone in suspense, Doc. Which one of us is the one who is worthy? The answer, I'm afraid, is not so clear. <laughs> Search your database for Christmas movies featuring aliens. Done. One reference. Holiday for Neptunians. Produced 1954. The alien transmission was taken from the film. I'll herd them and draw their fire. You do the rest. These are Earth-made toys. Cross-referencing known producers of flying saucer toys. You won't find a match for this stamp. Stamp does not match listed manufacturers. I just said that. Like any artist with a giant ego, he has to sign his work. Don't you, Funhouse? I was just playing around with my new toys, Batman. Is that so wrong? Based on criminal records, most of your actions are wrong. Felony robbery, parole violation, felony assault, jaywalking. Not now, Tornado. If you think we're going to let you continue your deranged rampage, you're wrong. 
Yes, yes. If ifs and buts were candy and nuts, we'd all have a Merry Christmas. Unfortunately, the games have only just begun tonight. It's a bomb. a war against an enemy he can't beat. Time. You flock like mindless drones to the mannequins and magazines that tell you how to dress and think. But you shun outsiders who don't fit your social cliques? This is a culture of garbage, and we're here to clean it up. Eating more smashing. Sorry, Katana. Kids? Not kids, Wildcat. Outsiders. You know these rabble rousers? Oh, yeah, Gramps. Bats has been trying to stop us for weeks. But we keep slipping away. Gramps! Careful, Wildcat. I can take care of myself. Question is, who's been taking care of you guys? maybe, but I ain't no reaper. I'm just a spirit, cursed to wander the earth. Another dead man like you. Only, I'm not dead. <laughs> Could have fooled me. I was buried alive and used an ancient Tibetan meditation technique to astral project out of my body. But when the air runs out in two hours, well, then I really will be dead. Maybe I can help, Mac. I can possess people, take total control of their bodies, make them do whatever. So how about I use this guy to dig up your body? No, my coffin has been booby-trapped. It's too dangerous to use a civilian. There has to be another way. It's your funeral. <laughs> Spirits of the dead, hear me! Thomas Baker, I summon you from the afterlife. Your nephew Colin wishes to speak with you. The spirit is among us. <gasps> Save your pennies, sir. This woman is a cheap charlatan. The proof is here. The one artifact with true power has been reduced to mere window dressing. Soon the city will tremble under its new master. Hope we can get your body back, because as unfair as life is, death is worse. For 
one suit, we're in agreement. No, oh, just great. All island-based units, priority command. Destroy Batman and Blue Beetle. Nice throw, but the countdown can't be stopped. And your failure ushers in a new era for mankind which... There's another way. The armor can get me inside the computer. I can override the safeties on the reactor. Destroy the island before the launch. Not bad. Do it. One problem. Getting off the island before the Big Bang. How much time will we have? Yeah, we should run. My hands are free. Dr. Choi, hello? Doctor, Aquaman here. What's new, old friend? I was just in the middle of conducting a delicate tachyon detection experiment, old friend. Tachyons, eh? Splendid! boy. Get to the point. I'm calling about Batman. He's, how shall I put this, shipping a bit of bilge. Describe the bilge. We were fighting that toxic torment camo, and the Cape Crusader... <laughs> Well, he took one in the face. I'll be right there. Outrageous! Oh. What miracle is this? As the atom, I can shrink to the size of a subatomic particle and ride electrons along the phone wires. Do it again! <coughs> oh my. <coughs> you don't look well at all. Open wide for me. Silicon based microorganisms? Specifically, fast replicating monoclinic philosilicates. What kind of medicine shall we prescribe, Doc? You don't know what kind of doctor I am, do you? A hero, Doctor. Through and through. A physicist. And this goes beyond medicine. Batman's cells are mutating. Before long, they'll overwhelm his central nervous system, causing a loss of motor control, then paralysis, and finally... Then we don't have much time. Chemo's headed out to sea, straight for the Bialian nuclear test site. Forget Chemo, old chum. The Navy can handle him. He's right. The only way to halt this process is for me to go into your body and destroy the organisms myself. Sounds like an adventure. Your power suit will respond to your will, much as our rings do. Nice. Now let's get moving. We need to make double time. Wait a minute. Who died and left you in charge? I put myself in charge. Got a problem with that? Yeah, I do. Your poor attitude annoys me. Oh, you want a piece of me too? The freedom of the entire universe is on the line. And our first duty is to the innocent people we sworn to protect and serve. You're right. Of course. The more we fight, the farther away Despero gets. Actually, I'm closer than you think. 
look upon my magnificence, the fullness of my power. Do you see now why there's no hope? Wowzer, that boy's had a real growth spurt. The universe needs control. You, of all men, must understand that. Okay, Guy, you and Nor take the left flank. Sinestro and I will take- Eat my toenail clippings. <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. Batman, sir. I'll take the left flank. Um, uh, which way's left? On my command. Fire! Ah! I knew I should have charged this... How did he ever get into the core? An influential uncle pulled a few strings. At least I can count on one man on this team. The armor and the ring work on the same principle. It's all about will. Focus that, and there's no limit to what I, we, can do. Well, well. If it isn't the prince and the pauper. Kill them both. Secure the totem. The totem can wait. It's a fox I want. <laughs> Poor Tiger. Nothing has changed. Master of martial arts, but not your own pride. At last, the power of the Wu-Dang totem is ours. That's what the totem does. The heroes aren't coming. Injustice Syndicate represent. Feel free to scream. Fun later. First the job. The Promethean 90. I'll get it. Instruction. You mustn't break the container or the isotope will be useless. It looks like I just got an easy way to end this. I'm the boss. I'll get it. You watch the door in case any guards get stupid. I heard you gentlemen were having a party. Mind if I crash it? So much for a world without heroes. But his timing couldn't be worse. Ah. 
Stay down or they'll kill you. I'm here to help. You? Help me? Is that some kind of sick joke? It's what you invited me here for, isn't it? You're from the parallel world. Here, put this on. It's a bad communicator. Be warned. I'm not much to look at. I'm sorry, Hood. For what? For this. I get it. We don't play well with others, so end of the day, neither of us can count on anyone but ourselves. Arrow, Beetle, anyone copy? I read you, Bats. You two clowns ready to pay your debt to society, earn a fresh start and a clean slate? O'Brien, you're in danger. Stay put. I'm coming to you. Nice try, Batman. Even you can't get the drop on me three times in one day. Ah! How did he do that? Hope you're hungry. You're about to be served a heaping double dip of justice. Remember our deal, Joker. <laughs> hey, I got the heroes off your back. How about a little gratitude? Say a phase oscillator, perhaps? Not feeling very gracious right now. <laughs> so, not hurt anyone. Hmm. Too toxic. Too stabby. Too fruity. Say, where's my... The real one will move. He always does. Absolutely exhilarating! I could get used to this hero stuff. Looks like there are some new arrivals to the neighborhood. Great stars! The Eye of Zarin! They found it, and they're almost finished excavating it. It's time for Operation Sea Sanction. We're outnumbered, Adam. There may be a better way. Aquaman, can your telepathy summon the ocean creatures to help us against the Gordanians? Suppose we could try. The horned whales of Abix. Excellent. Have them flank the Gordanian excavation crew and draw their fire while we head straight into the middle and... Go! Get out of here! Now! What is wrong with you? You've been nothing but an albatross around the neck of this mission. I heard stories of your great heroism, but clearly they were works of great fiction. You want some of me, helmet boy? Adam, Aquaman and I need a moment alone. Come on, let's see how far the Gordanian's excavation has gotten. We've been friends a long time, Aquaman. I've never known you to be depressed or half-hearted or unheroic. Well, it's just... I was on patrol last month when I received word that some beluga whales were being illegally hunted in the Bering Sea. I reached the whales, it was too late. I was too late. It wasn't a daring exploit or a heroic adventure. It was a tragedy. And it was my fault. your last painting, Crazy Quilt. 
You can paint your own masterpieces from your new studio, a cell in Arkham Asylum. A demon! He is a hero. It's obvious by the bright blue and yellow in his costume. The mask means he must be well-known, perhaps a wealthy entrepreneur with ample free time. Square jaw indicates strong lineage, perhaps a doctor's son. And the bat motif, most surely inspired by some childhood trauma. The masked bat, perhaps? Actually, it's Batman. Sherlock Holmes, I presume. How did you deduce my identity so quickly? The hat. <clears throat> Back to the matter at hand. Jason Blood has been accused of crimes he did not commit and summoned you to his aid. Jason Blood? Where is he? In a spot of trouble, I'd say. Demon! He's in league with devils! Thank you, Batman. They think I'm some kind of monster. Last time I checked, you were. I'm only bonded with Etrigan. We are two different beings, neither of whom are responsible for these attacks. We need to keep a low profile until we can learn more about these crimes. 